the You're current... You're calling for revolution. Yeah, absolutely. The, the apathy doesn't come from us, the people. The apathy comes from the politicians. They are apathetic to our needs. They're only interested in servicing the needs of corporations. Look. I'm calling for genuine alternatives. So because the time is now, these movements are already occurring, it's happening everywhere. We're in a time where communication is instantaneous and there are communities all over the world. The Occupy movement made a difference, in, even if only in that it introduced to the popular public lexicon the idea of the 1% versus the 99%. People for the first time in a generation are aware of massive corporate and economic exploitation. These things are not nonsense and these subjects are not being addressed. They're, no one's doing anything about about tax havens. No one's doing anything about their political affili affiliations and financial affiliations of the Conservative Party. So until people start addressing things that are actually real, why wouldn't I be facetious? Why would I take it seriously? Why would I encourage a constituency of young people that are absolutely indifferent to vote? Why would we? Aren't you bored? Aren't you more bored than anyone? And you've been talking on year after year, listening to their lies, their nonsense. Then it's this one gets in, then it's that one getting in. But this problem continues. Why are we going to continue to contribute to this facade?